You know, I just don't know how people fucking stand it. <laughs> and I wonder how many people don't even notice this. Where I am, <coughs> I'm sitting here on this lovely, it is ha <coughs> Halloween, baby. It is uh, Thursday, October 31st. 2024 and uh, I am in my native Hotlanta GA where the little dog I think has gotten the chippy he can just add to the cacophony it is Thursday October 31st 2024 Sancho no barking Sancho, no barking. Get the chippy, but no barking. That chippy, but no barking. Here comes the leaf blower. Oh, Jesus. So I'm back in my native Hotlanta, Georgia. This is in the leafy suburb of Sandy Springs. I honestly think I'm sitting in the remnants of our old family farm just you know in, the, in this beautiful expensive look at this this abortion next door this thing has been under construction for three years this thing uh, <laughs> next door to this house and you know I'm sitting here in these million dollar homes in this leafy tony suburb of sandy springs in north atlanta i mean there's deer walking around there there's deer walking around out here there's rabbits uh raccoons possums of course squirrels chipmunks i heard an owl hooting last night it's uh <laughs> It seems to be as rich in wildlife as bugs in a jar farm, and it's this. This is. I, I can't tell even what, of course, what the microphone is picking up. I mean, this is just what it sounds like. It's not quite this bad after midnight but but this this is pretty much 24 7 it is like this is 10 o'clock on an average thursday morning uh sitting here in this tony leafy suburb of million dollar homes in in, in just one big city It bugs in a jar farm, you know, when you, particularly when you're sitting up at Seahorse and you really have your ear tuned, you can hear that goddamn fracking support quarry three miles away. You can hear them grinding up the, you know, pulverizing the mountain into gravel. If you really listen closely, that, and they're not even working on this uh, on this house next door. So there's no construction noise coming from that house next door. Uh, This is just the ambient noise of global industrial civilization. And <clears throat> sounds like we have another, another leaf blower. These goddamn leaf blowers, I think they've made them uh, illegal. And they illegal uh, all over the state of California. I, I know more and more of these rich towns 
are making these goddamn leaf blowers illegal at least uh, before nine o'clock in the morning. You know, I was at that Airbnb in the middle of nowhere in, uh, in, in Kentucky this time yesterday morning. And that guy uh, out, out in the middle of nowhere, that guy who saved my ass, uh, you know, getting my trailer on my truck, he brings out his leaf blower. And here I am, 24 hours later. There must be three of these goddamn things. <coughs> A leaf blower. <sighs> Good God, there goes another one. The Battle of the Leaf Blowers. So I guess what's happening, so I, <coughs> I, I, I think there's one guy in one yard blowing his leaves, probably over into his neighbor's yard, and the guy, you know, his neighbor has his leaf blower and is blowing his leaves into his neighbor's yard. So I'm guessing what we have is this big wall of leaves going down their uh, property line between their two mansions uh, you know blowing leaves uh, and then one big gust of wind is going to come up and blow the whole fucking pile of leaves all over the place again You know, they, they, these people who, who spend a million, easily a million dollars. That that damn thing next door, as they say, they've three years been under construction. That, that thing is at least a three million dollar mansion if they ever finish it. So they, they do all of this to live in this neighborhood. <clears throat> and this is what it sounds like. Humans. And I had my barking dog <coughs> to the mix. You know, j just to be one of our fellow Earthlings, uh, <clears throat> they're trying to coexist with us. I mean, listen to this shit. And my friend, she's sound asleep. She just, she just, uh, <laughs> you know, and she's a doomer chick. It just sleeps right through this. This is just, this is just normal. And all of this shit is going down. It's just a, it's just going to be the deafening silence of the collapse of global industrial civilization. I'm sure Peter Lind, Peter, I'm sure you have a something to say about the uh, <laughs> the silence of the grave that awaits global industrial civilization when, when all of this shit just, just goes silent one day. And I 
I know you guys can't hear it. I, I hear a woodpecker in the in the middle of all of this. There is a woodpecker tapping away on the <laughs> tapping away on the dead tree. Uh, those damn noisy ass woodpeckers. I you know I, I get pissed off at the woodpeckers at Bugs in a Jar Farm for waking me up in the morning. There's goddamn noisy woodpeckers out there pecking on my trees at Bugs in a Jar Farm. Oh, Jesus. I think we have a drone flying over it. Sounds that a drone? Ugh. You know, these goddamn drones, when you look at the forecast for them, there's going to be millions of these things. Uh, it, 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 just add that to the that whole layer of cacophony. Uh, you know, each one sounds like a fucking lawnmower. And imagine on top of all of this, we have a bunch of lawnmowers flying through the sky. Anyway, it sounds like the the leaf blowers are the war of the leaf blowers seems to have wound down. So we're back just to the steady hum. You just you just can't escape it. <clears throat> So I guess people come out here and they're uh, back in their multi-million dollar backyards in their leafy Tony suburbs and they put on headphones and listen to the sounds of nature through their headphones as they, as they forest bathe. Oh, Jesus, we're so fucked. All right. I gotta wrap this up and uh, go find my little dog because we have to head to Petco. Sancho, are you ready to go get your Halloween costume? We have to go get Sancho's Halloween costume from Petco so he can greet the trick-or-treaters tonight. Get out there and then enjoy the sounds of global industrial civilization while you still can before they all say bye-bye. Bye guys.